Hey guys, what's going on? It's Low for Low Nose Tech. And in a previous video, I reviewed this Hainer Seek podcast equipment bundle, which comes with the audio interface, a microphone, boom arm, and all the things that you need to, for yourself to get going. So go ahead, uh, check out the full review right here and see what you think about it. But in this particular video, I have three goals in mind. Number one, can you connect higher quality microphones to this audio interface? Number two, how do you connect multiple microphones to this audio interface because it has an XLR and two mic inputs that are not XLR. So how do we go, how, we, how do we go about doing that? And number three, well, what's the difference between using a high quality mic compared to the mic that comes with it? So with that being said, we're going to test four microphones on this audio interface. Uh, the first one is the one that we're using right now, the Hainer Seek uh, T03-8 80C microphone. This is the one that comes with the actual kit. Then we're going to use the TZ, oh, oops. Then we're going to use the TZ Audio Products Stellar microphone. Uh, and then we're going to have right here our, uh, our Neumann TLM 49. Again, this, this podcast bundle comes in just under $200. This microphone's about $300. And then this microphone is probably like $1,600. And then we're going to test out this lavalier microphone as well to get us going. Okay, so the first way to connect a high quality microphone to this audio interface is through XLR. This does take XLR and the cord is XLR to XLR mini. So all you need is just a microphone that accepts 48 volts, such as the Stellar and uh, the Neumann and or whatever condenser microphone that you have that accepts 48 volts. So we're going to connect this microphone directly to this audio interface with the XLR to XLR mini. Uh, powering the microphone through 48 volts. So let's switch it out right now. All right, 48 volts activated. Yeah, all right, so here we go. The Stellar, uh, the Stellar TZ Audio Products Condenser Microphone. Again, all you need to do is just activate the 48 volts and then you're powered through this, going the XLR through the XLR Mini. So really, really simple, really straightforward. Let me know in the comments down below, what do you think about the microphone, uh, this, the, the sound differences between these two microphones, the one that actually comes with the kit and this microphone uh, here now we're going to use this microphone as our main microphone throughout the rest of the video now let's connect this microphone to this kit now i want you to keep in mind this microphone does require in order for it to be connected this is an xlr microphone but again we're using on our xlr uh our, our xlr ports so we have to connect this microphone to the 3.5 millimeter stereo jack jack within this within this audio interface so how do we do that well you don't have to use what i'm using the main thing is you want something to, that's going to supply the 48 volts to your microphone and give you a line out to um, your audio interface. So, for example, I'm going to be using this audio interface. And the way I'm going to do that, I'm going to feed the 48 volts from this device to the microphone. And the way I'm going to get the sound out to the interface is using the stereo, is using the headphone jack right here in the front. Same thing I would use for the headphones. I would just connect it to there. So, let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and plug it into mic one first. We're connected. Then I'm going to set up my microphone and activate uh, and then turn on the 48 volts and adjust my levels. All right, so now we have both microphones connected to this device. And again, this is being powered by the audio interface and I'm able to adjust the levels on it from here through the audio interface. And again, it is coming through the headphone out jack going into here. Um, once again, let me know what you think about it. The, the sound of this microphone compared to the other microphones or the original microphone in the comment section down below. Again, pretty straightforward. We have this microphone working and then we have this microphone working. So we have dual microphones working at the same time. Now you can actually introduce a third microphone because remember we have three microphone ports for this device. So let's go ahead and connect this la my lavalier microphone to mic jack number two and see what that looks like. And we'll connect it in. Now I'm gonna remove this microphone so we're not getting in the way. All right, so I wanna get a, a little further away from uh, from the other microphones, but yeah, so now we are so now we have three microphones connected in using the lavalier microphone. Uh, and yeah, really simple. So. Again, you even though you can use a device that'll connect it through 48 volts, if you have a microphone that connects directly through a 3.5 millimeter jack, give you power and power that microphone, you can with that. And it's pretty simple. All right, so what are my final thoughts? Let's uh, let's disconnect this. Uh, let's let's get something clear. Let's get some clear uh, going on so I can get my, my final thoughts for this uh, for you. All right, so here we go. Um, you can't connect multiple microphones to this kit. Pretty simple. Again, XLR, XLR mini, just fine. As something that'll give you a 48 volts here uh, to your microphone to line out and back into, it, back into it. Now, the only thing you're gonna have to overcome is this device, this one mic fader here. So you have one fader controlling all the mics. So uh, the, the lavalier mic and the mic that says connected, 
that one fader is going to control both. So maybe one mic might be stronger than the other. You're not going to have a balanced level. But with this, if you connect to a separate device, you can use the gain knob uh, or the output knob to balance your levels according to that. So I just want to keep uh, give you give you that tidbit. But yeah, connecting uh, high high quality microphones to this device, super simple, super simple, super fast. Really hope that helps. All right, guys. Well, what do you think? Let me know. I want to know what you think about this setup or what microphone you'd like to see connected uh, to this. If you have any questions about it, uh, let me know. Again, don't forget, I'll leave all the links uh, for everything you see here down below. And also, learn, do, and share. I'll catch, I'll catch you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.